Everybody, welcome back to another fucking Scream shit. I don't know, Scream News, whatever the fuck I'm gonna call it. And the new trailer that I haven't done a video on yet. It came out 13 hours ago, so. It's technically official, it's technically the second trailer, so I might be doing a breakdown of it. Yeah, I'm gonna do a breakdown of it, so. Not gonna get through a lot, but. I'll just keep this on here, because why the fuck wouldn't I? So. Scream 6. Alright, let's, let's try or 2. Got a fucking ad. Fucking hell, you fucking piece of dog shit orphanage. Thank you. Come on, hurry up. Damn, fucking... So the first opening shot is of the fucking door, which was like, I don't know what type of door it is. Fuck off! Okay. Get, and the ghost face comes up to it. So he apparently breaks through the glass. They're running. He jumps, which I don't think I ever saw a ghost face jump so fucking high. They shut the door. Apparently there's blood all over the fucking door. And someone locks it. And they're doing this crosswalk against the... Uh, from a window to another window with a fucking ladder. Which I wouldn't trust that shit at all. Like literally, why would you trust a fucking ladder to hold your weight up? Like literally. If I got on that, my fast would have been fucking... That ladder would have snapped in half before I even got on that. So they're going across the... Ghostface is breaking through the fucking door. <laughs> Whoever the fuck this girl is. And Ghostface is pushed through the door. They're climbing. Well, Mindy is climbing through. Well, climbing. Eee! Walking across the goddamn ladder. I can't fucking speak. <laughs> okay. I want to be able to fucking do that because I'm scared of ice. Whatever. Um, she's walking across it. Ghostface is there. So I'm guessing when he stabs down on it, I guess he like stabs her fucking foot. Yeah, wait. Maybe, I'm not sure. Cops come. Kirby, is that her name? Kirby Reed, I think. Comes back, talking to the police. There's a whole fucking, I think... What's it called? Museum? Whatever fucking call it. Of... Uh, all the fucking costumes of Ghostface. All the characters are there. Court, oh well, Gail Weathers is there. And that's fu then there's one scene where the fucking lights flicker police. And where, um, Tara's holding on with Sam's hand. I guess she, she's about to drop her... Whatever the hell is going to happen there. Then you get the final scene where Ghostface is in the fucking subway train. Whatever the fuck I'm going to call it. And he attacks Mindy. Oh, never mind. Ghostface goes through the fucking um, store. And then there's another scene where they're talking. Yeah, the um, other scene where um, Sam is pointing the gun with all a lot of blood all over. That scene is right there. Then one scene where Ghostface, or a whole bunch of other ones, and then Sam and Terror are fighting against them. And uh, Ghostface slashes, and the trailer two ends there. I know I might miss. I might have missed a lot. I might not like. Dead a lot, might not, I don't know, that's all I could f fucking look at is because of the trailer. That's all that was in the trailer. I don't know the new characters, I know there's names for them somewhere posted, but I don't know where the fuck they're posted at, so. But, trailer 2, it's fucking, wow. I can't wait to watch it, I mean that ass. 
Videos are gonna be coming out on that fucking movie very soon. Whenever I get the fucking whenever it comes to streaming services. But overall, Screen Six looks so fucking good. If you haven't watched the video where I um, did a video on the five characters that I want to that I want to see survive in Screen Six, go watch that. But a lot of people want Tara to survive so they can bring her back in another sequel. Which I I feel like like they should do that, but you know, also. People said, um, Bill, um, Stu Mocker has a daughter, which I don't get how he had a daughter because he was bleeding out and shit. And I understand that if Stu Mocker actually did have a daughter, that he would go after their his daughter would actually go after Tara and Sam because they're they are the daughters of Billy Loomis. And Billy Loomis fucked up Stu in the fucking movie where he says, you cut me too deep and shit. Now, I feel like that's revenge. But, after Scream 6, Scream 7 is the last third um, of the trilogy, or they might make an eighth one, which I'm fine with. And also, they need to continue Halloween. I want to see more of Michael Myers. I don't give a fuck what they do with it. Just has to be good as David Gore Green's trilogy. Like, literally. I don't care if it's new actors. I don't care if it's di different directors. They just need to make it perfect. Or, they could bring back James Hood, <laughs> James Hood Courtney. But, Scream 6. And, apparently, there's a fucking secret character appearance in it. Maybe it's Stu Mocker or Billy Loomis. Well, the original actor from Ski Ulrich, I think that's his name. But who knows? I don't know the new characters, but when we get to um, see them and know their names, we'll know. I wonder what the ending of the movie is, because I don't believe it's where Ghostface survives. There's no way. And, pe and when they say in the new trailer, this is a different Ghostface. That's what they said about the last movie. Like, literally, didn't they say that about the last movie? I don't know. Um, how long is this fucking? Uh, yeah. So I I've been going on for ten minutes. Well, almost ten minutes. Uh, and also apparently this is a Super Bowl ad, which fucking. Yeah, this is what I'm talking about. This scene right here. Maybe he stabs down on Mindy's leg. Um, I'll be too much of a pussy to do this. From a ladder to a fucking another window. Fuck that. Like, Larry, fuck that. Uh, well, it was a life de death situation. Well, that's not even that much. That's not even heights. Maybe, I'm not sure. Oh, yeah. Fuck that. <laughs> yeah, because you see that shit? It's like New York where Spider-Man is. Yeah. Like, that is fucking crazy. You have to have some big balls to cross that. I guess I'm happy she's back. I'm not sure. This is what I'm talking about, the museum or fucking whatever you call it. With all, I don't know if these are from the original movie. Like, every single one from the other movies. It could be because there's like at least like one, two, three, four, five, six. There and there wasn't even nine movies, there's actually at least five. Well, six now. No seven. That's why I'm talking about the scene where this scene and also this scene where she has gun up and shit. I don't know if that's Gail's new boyfriend. I'm not sure. Because I don't think she would get a boyfriend after her best friend died, Dewey. But. It's. It's kind of stupid that, um. 
if you know there's a black guy in every horror movie, you already know what's going to happen. They end up getting killed first, which is kind of fucked up and racist. I don't know why they did that. Like, I don't know why they do that in fucking movies. Like, it's, like, I like it where black guys are the survivors in horror movies. I feel like it's fucking cool. And it doesn't always have to be white people. Like, can't it just be black people and white people that survive, please? Instead of black people just dying all the time. But, uh, that's about it. Uh, more reviews coming on the channel soon. More commentaries, more movie reviews, more a whole lot of other shit. Um, more movie versus movies. And, uh, that's about it. Keep sucking dick. And, um, yeah.